See, the funny thing about nightmares is that they don't last long. And you, Tepe, you won't last long in this competition. Now, the last time we met, the odds were in my favor. And they still are. Now, accolades aside, Teddy, I'm not afraid of you. I have no reason to be. Because, see, like I said, nightmares don't last long. And you ain't that much of a nightmare, son. Now, yeah, my adrenaline's pumping, yeah. I'm not feeling the greatest. I feel like my chest is about to collapse. But this is a competition, son, and I'm coming for what's mine. I'm coming for the demoness. And like I told everybody before, I'm going to keep coming. I'm not going to stop. Why would I stop now? Why would I bow down to the nightmare, the unnatural one? The only thing unnatural about you is your hairline. And I'm just saying, bro, I mean, that's the only thing scary about you. But other than that, man, I got to come for what's mine. I got to go for the promo title. I'm going for the promo championship. Now, all hair jokes aside, because I know my hair is not the best looking neither, but at least I'm not laying there eating a bag of chips and laughing at something that's not funny. This ain't funny, boy. This ain't a game. Son, I'm hustling out here. And I'm going to pave the way all the way to the top until I get to the demoness. Now, demoness, I know you're watching this, and I know you're watching this from hell. When we met last time, I wasn't ready, but this time, I'm coming for you, with a smile on my face, but first, I gotta get through Ted P, now, whatever you gonna say, Teddy, say it, don't hold back, don't be no punk, bruh, just let me have it. And at the end of the day, man, let the best man win, partner. Because I told you, I'm hungry. And I'm going to keep eating till I get full and become the next king of the might winner. And then after that, your title's mine, demoness. I need some gold around my waist, so I'll catch you real soon. Time to go back to sleep, man. Woke up too early. <laughs> you be exposing bitches. Why? No, I'm not one for the snitch. And that is the definition of De Niro. Yes. I may have been down, but I picked myself back up and got right back in this race. Hello, Corey. I see you're standing in my way once again, just like Mr. Jolly was. But we've tangled before, Corey. We have, and I, I didn't care about that one. This one, quite different. I actually care about, and that is the perfect way. See, it's a beautiful rhythm when you think about it. I fell short of King of the Mic last year and the person who really stood in my way is you the funny thing is i knew that i had you coming up i knew it i look right past mike jolly like hey mike excuse me not talking I'm talking to Corey. hello Corey. hello cypher the rap spitter yeah snake in the grass got they ass Put his ass on blast. Pow! 
Shot in the face. What a disgrace. I'm not really rapping. Those are just rhyming words. But that's what you guys wanted. Right? You guys wanted a battle rap from me and Corey the last time we had it set up. It was billed as a battle rap. But I once again, I said I will not, will not battle anybody unless the De Niro is right. And might add, maybe that's a bit cocky, but when you know your price... You know your price. But Cypher is one of the best rappers I've ever heard. Look inches away from me when it comes to this promo thing. See, you may walk the said walk, but I talk the said talk. I lay that motherfucker. You can walk right on it because it's solid it's concrete do you understand what i'm saying or are you a little lost catch up if you're lost come here let me talk to you let me talk to you hey you're in my way Corey. i would like for you to please move because we are boys but trippy wolf was your boy too correct I mean, need not say anything else, but this is getting long, and I would hate to bore anybody with my ramblings and tangents, but you have to understand this. What's understood doesn't need to be explained, and if you don't get it, it's probably not for you to get. Take me out.